I've got something that might interest you, stranger. Another episode of Mega Man X. And we're going to take on Boomer Kawanger. I don't know what the heck that is, but that's okay. They've broken away from the Drill Man, Mega Man, Toad Man, Flash Man, Feral Man, Boss Man, Name Man. And uh, now we got Boomer Kawanga. It's like, uh, right. Anyway, uh, this stage I hate a ton. I hate the boss and I hate the stage. But there's nothing I can do about it, so we're just gonna go. And I'm gonna showcase the, uh, the Chameleon Sting. It has probably the best charge of ability in the game because it makes you invulnerable, which is absolutely sick. Invulnerability is just... What, what, what can you say? You're invulnerable! So, I kind of love it. For obvious reasons. Anyway, we're taking out these toad things, these Cooper-looking things. And, uh, you know, here we go. Just gonna try and light up some guys as they try and score free kills on me. I don't know how I got out of there without getting hit. That was amazing. <laughs> wow. Awesome. Alright, so the level's nearly over. Hard parts are gone. Oh, God, this, although this part just sucks. It's not much in distance, but it's so much in time. It just takes too long for nothing to happen. Oh, oh well. Anyway, so what's going on, guys? Actually, uh, between these episodes, before I was, before I started to play this one, I just found out that Steve Carell is leaving The Office. Like, what? Seriously? That's one of the two TV shows that I watch. One of two! And now it's going to be ruined. I don't know what they're going to do without him. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. I'm sure many of you guys watch The Office. Hell, you Brits are probably like, hey, you jacked our show! But that's alright. <laughs> Anyway, so we have some shotgun ice, which, by the way, you see how that bounces off? That's sick. That's so sick. Wait for this guy to move. And we gotta jump up here. Pick up our heart container. And... Use some more chameleon sting to get through here quicker. And let's just go. Ah, crap. There we go. Look at that. Look at that. Look how much more fun that is. When, you, when you're invulnerable. Oh, crap. Fine. 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 I'll charge it up again. Fine. I'll charge it up again. I'm invulnerable. I love it. I love it. There's so much going on. The game is lagging. The game is lagging. All right. So there's a couple ways I like to fight this guy. Um, normally, since I did a weird pattern this time, Normally I don't have his weakness at this point. So, because I usually fight him last or second to last. Well, I guess if I fight him last, I have it. But, um, anyway, so he's actually really easy with his... Seriously? Seriously? Alright, fine. I'll just be a douche and stay up where you can't get me. Whatever. Hit him with homing missiles and it takes care of him real quick. You want to shoot one like every half a second. That way you're always hitting him with something. And, shoot him in different directions because they're homing anyway. And he's really easy with that. But otherwise, he is a royal pain in the ass. He's so hard. I hate him. I hate him. I hate him. Anyway, he's dead. Although I guess now that I have a 50% armor upgrade, he probably wouldn't be too bad. Anyway, we get boomerang cutter. Yada, yada, yada. Big deal. We're going to keep on going. Alright, so we took care of him. And this leaves Spark Mandrill in the south, in the power plant. I need Surf to get there. Maybe a ground type, like Golem. Alright, it's another sick stage music here. Alright, so we got this guy, just get in his grill and rapid fire him, he stands no chance if you're fast. Oh, that guy really stands no ch chance if you're charged up. Oh, that was quick. <laughs> oh, yeah. Eat it! Actually, I think... Okay, see that tank over there? That is the reason we, uh... We had to fight this guy first. And I don't remember... 
Oh, you gotta go down. Thank you. There you go. You gotta make it go down, which you have to be moving down as it comes up. So, plus if you notice, look at the energy on that. It restores the energy when I get my boomerang back, which is really sweet. Anyway, that was why we needed to kill him first. So now we just uh, head back up here instead. God, you know, for a Spark Mandro guy, you'd think he'd have more light. Alright, this doesn't look good. That's not what I wanted to do. I so rarely use special weapons in Mega Man games, I figure I'll just start throwing crap. Oh, this guy. Ah, uh, this little mini boss. Now, there's not too many mini bosses in this game, actually. This is one of the few. And he tries to uh, get you stuck in this water, but uh, you can work your way out of it with dashing. And uh, he gets royally wrecked by some tornado blow. Or whatever the heck this is. God, come down here! God, you're not supposed to take this long to kill, seriously? Thank you. I don't know why that took so long. Oh, purple Mega Man head! Alright. Well, we'll just keep this ability on. I love this ability, man. It just it takes care of everything. What are you doing? Get out of here. Punk. There we go, especially those guys. It's designed for those guys. Anyway, I don't know how many of you saw that. There's the heart up there. So we're going to get our way up here, which is actually really tough to get. Because I am so not good at dash jumping. I don't know why, I'm just not. Ah. There we go. And look at that, now our health and our magic are the same. Gonna keep on going, taking out these cats, stroking some cats. I haven't said that in forever. That was like my phrase in. When was it? I don't know, I said that a lot in like 2008. Oh crap, wrong button. Give me the invulnerability! God, give me invulnerability, thank you, I just wanna go. Oh, figures, he's right here. Alright, so we're gonna switch to shotgun ice, but we're not gonna charge it up. Got some ice cube and some vanilla ice going on all at once. Ice, ice, baby. Oh, this is fail. This is major fail. Are you serious? There we go. This is how it's supposed to work. Much better. There you go. I don't know what the heck that was at the start. That's never happened. I don't know what that was, but it was ugly. No big deal. Dead. Alright. Got Electric Spark, which unfortunately is going to be the worst ability in the game, but that's alright. And in a game like Mega Man X, when every ability is good, calling it the worst of all the good ones, it's that's not always a bad thing. But. This one is unfortunately just pretty bad, so what can you do? They can't all be epic. Oh, what am I doing over there? There we go. And the final guy we got is in the northeast, in the caves or something, I guess. Mount Moon. Dude looks like a tank, that's for sure. Hey, it's Fortress! Volcano Bake Meat. Alright. Let's see, first I want to look at... Alright, I've got one and a half sub-tanks full. And i got one still empty. That's alright. I'll worry about that later. Right now I just want to kill some stuff. Sit towards the back of this thing. Ah, I missed. I was supposed to go flying through here. Let's just keep trucking. 
Alright, what am I doing here? I forget what I'm doing here. I think I did this wrong. Yeah, I just did this wrong. Whatever. Don't! Oh well. I did it wrong. I'll go back. Wake up! Alright, sorry about that guys. Wasting some time there. Hit in the U-Tank over here. I just, uh... I got mixed up in my mind, I guess, on what I was doing. But I'm picking up the secrets. I know I'm doing that. Give me that. Ah, I got hit. Ah, I got hit again. I don't care that much. Whatever. 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 Let's go. Right, so here we want to lay down a big shield of pink death, I guess. Fire a few bullets, take a leap of faith, and get in front of this guy. As you saw how I did that really quick and fluidly. Pick up our last heart container. I don't know why they did it this way. But they give us more health than they give us magic. Whatever. We get a pink charge, and once we get close to the birds, let it rip. As if the game lags and we fire kill all these things. And then up top, no, I got hit! No, are you serious? Oh my god. Really? Wow, that's fail. Alright then, well that was interesting. I guess we'll have to go back. Alright, stay towards the back here so you can pick up items and hopefully don't get hit. And then this time the heads have the pink death kill all the birds, that'd be nice. There, it took them all out that time, I don't see what the problem is. Alright, so we pick up that little secret health. And we got to fight versus the armadillo now. And we want to go to the weapon that I just said was really bad. It has one use, this boss. Right, so he's got a couple of attacks. But first let's break his armor. And then we're going to wait for him to move because that's too close for my... Actually... Thank you. There you go. I'm gonna fire like every half second, or no, every second, pretty much. Doesn't matter, he's a piece of cake. You just gotta break the armor with the electricity. And once his armor is gone, he's a piece of cake. Though that was a very ugly fight. Whatever. Don't care, fool. And that takes out the eight Mavericks, guys. It, uh, it seemed pretty quick, but... You know, Rolling Shield, the second worst weapon in the game. The only reason it's better than Electricity is because it's secondary is really good. But, uh... Oh, hey, we got a little cutscene here. I almost, uh... I almost just cut the video off. Finally, we found Sigma's Fortress! Let's go in and put an end to his war against the humans! All right. Thanks, Zero. Where have you been this whole time? What have you been doing? I've been taking out all these guys and picking up all these secrets and look at all these places I had to travel to. Just look at it, Zero. Look at it. What have you done? What have you done? Punk-ass, lazy, son of a robot? No, he's not son of a robot. It's the first word that came to mind. <laughs> Alright, so we got a few orders of business still, though, guys. Let's take care of them real quick. There's just one little bit of backtracking. You gotta have at least one stage of it. Alright, that's it. Let's go! Let's go! So, because there's only a... Every stage I did in the order, so I wouldn't have to do as many stages, but, uh... Kinda... Kinda needed some abilities to get the one in here, so... Only so much you can do in that regard. Oh well! 
before making good time. Look familiar? Aha! Can't touch this. I'm MC Mega. Almost there, guys. Oh, remember that? Well, last time, I didn't jump up. Oh, God, you stupid dragonfly. Seriously? Seriously? Oh, my goodness, I can't jump out. Thank you. All right, I couldn't get... I didn't get up here last time because I didn't have fire, which can bust these and get me the last secret. Let me bust that over. And fall into the abyss! You don't really have to do that, actually. I just felt like it. Because I can. Actually, you're wasting time. Once you beat a stage, you have this nifty little exit thing, so... Let's just exit our level real quick and get the heck out of Dodge! And go back to Kansas. Alright, so this leaves us with one final little secret to get. And we're gonna get it. So let's go get it. Alright, this one... It's kind of a secret. It's more like a little... Well, I don't know. It's meh. But it's, def it's at least something that's, you know, not normal to uh, Mega Man's base abilities. So... We're gonna pick it up. Because it's 100% wrong, so, you know, it's how we roll up in here. So, first, there's a, there's a lot of conflicting data on how you get this secret, as there's a lot of different ways that you can search for online. And I'm not positive what the exact minimalistic requirements are. Um, first of all, that bad, he's like a special dude. He has a 50% chance to drop a free life, so, he's pretty nice. But, uh, anyway, so you need all the secrets, or every other secret, I should say. And then you need, which, I mean, that means all the hearts, all the sub-tanks, all the, uh, weapon capsules. And you need to have beaten all eight stages, so you need every special weapon. And then you have to fill up all your energy tanks to full, or sub-tanks to full. And I think you need nine, or no, I don't think you need nine lives. But a lot of people say that you do. So we're just going to get 9 lives anyway, as we fill up our sub-tanks. And then once we have all of that, then I will diverge more into the process that is obtaining the secret. This is definitely, in my opinion, the best grinding spot anyway, so... Alright, almost there. Almost there. Almost there! Man, he's definitely not dropping 50%, he's dropping like 40. Oh well. I don't really know uh, how much more is there. Hey, we're done, alright. That's how much more there was left to go. I don't know why I'm still killing bats. Bats! They're everywhere! They suck! Alright, I still need... Let's just get one more life, just in case. Just in case. I don't know why I'm killing those guys. There we go. Alright, nine lives. There we go. So now, some people say that you have to go through the stage without taking any hits. Some people say you just have to get to the end of it at full life, and uh, then there's people who go, well, you have to use that exit feature you just saw me use in Show Penguin stage. You have to use that. And, and some people just think, like, no, you, you can just die and respawn and die again. Because you have to get to the end of the level after you have all these other requirements, and then you have to die four times, or exit four times, depending on your point of view and what you think is actually true. Anyway, I've, I've never had a problem just dying and respawning and dying four times. And uh, I've never had an issue needing nine lives before it either. But, uh, you know, that's how we roll. And, uh, yeah. And once you get all that, you find the last little secret area. And there should be a special secret. And I actually mean special secret, like literally a special secret, as you shall see. not as significant. And then, remember this spot? Gotta get back up here, pick up this health, and then we gotta die four times and rinse and repeat. 
Boom, 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 boom. And just rinse and repeat. And you guys may be, uh... Oh, crap. Well, that sucks. That wasn't supposed to happen at all. <laughs> I was about to say, you guys may be interested in just skipping ahead for a minute or two. Well, I guess more like two minutes. But, uh, you know, because I'm just going to have to go back to that pit and then die four times. Hopefully not die on douchebag again. And, uh, you know... I've explained all the trick, and you just want to make sure that you click back in time for actually seeing the capsule itself. But, uh, otherwise, yeah, not too much to say, since I just have to die a bunch. Totally almost missed that jump. Look at that background, though. That background's kind of sweet. For an SNES game like that? How many is that? Is that two times? I think that's two times. Almost out of my uh, chameleon sting. That's not good. Not good. Awesome, nice. Got a large pickup there. Really helpful. Alright, that should be three, so we should just have to die once more and then come back a fifth time, I do believe. We should be good! Oh, I didn't mean to let that go. Oh well. Oh well. Hopefully this is the last time we gotta use it. Aside from, of course, right here. Just so we don't get hit when we jump up to the secrets. Oh, here it is already. Here it is. Check this out. Look at his headband. I give you a special present. I told you it was a special capsule. Now, enter the capsule, please. Enter the capsule. Do it now, Mega Man. Got a nice uh, Street Fighter Ryu headband on Dr. Light up there. It's pretty chill. Here we go. You ready? You ready? Can you guys even hear that? That was really quiet. That was kind of quiet. Anyway, he, uh, he shoots out Ryu's Hadoken attack, which is kind of awesome. You can only use it at full life, and uh, I don't think you can use it in the air, actually. You, you have to be at full hit points to use it. No, you can't use it in the air, which sucks. And uh, as far as how you use it, well, it's just, you know, typical Ryu Hadoken. If you've never played a Street Fighter game and you don't know what Hadoken is, then, uh, I don't know what to say. So, yeah. That's it open, guys. Now let's go play some Mega Man. And attack Sigma's Fortress! Yes! Oh, crap. I guess I gotta get out of the stage real quick here. Yeah. This way is a little bit better, I think. And there is your password, ladies and gentlemen, for 100% with Sigma's stage untouched. So all you gotta do is, you know, go through Sigma's Fortress. So, there that is. That's one of the few significant passwords in the game. That's about it.